Greetings and salutations, I'm Kev. Welcome back to this let's play of City Skylines, Circle City, roundabout now. And we're out of the time skip. And I've been doing quite a few things. Uh, as you might notice, I've <laughs> I've been gridding quite a lot. I'm pretty much gridding the entire map to finish. I do believe I also tweaked the last few uh, roads out here out on MS Point. And we've hooked up some new stations down there. Those are very new, so they're not functional yet. But, uh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah, so I'm pretty much done gridding. Um, so now it's just a matter of growing the town. So I figured it was time to leave the time skip. Um, I still haven't started the uh, industrial areas. So I've zoned it out to a mining area here in Moria. At least, if I remember right, yeah, it has marked the, has the uh, ore mark there. I'm gonna get the oil fields out here and up in the corner here because that's what we had resources for. Also marked a little foresting area here, forestry area. Yeah, so we're gonna build there. Other than that, it is just a matter of growing the city. So we're gonna do that for a while. And it did cost quite a bit to grid all this, by the way. Uh, cost a few million. But it is done. And we have some highway connections up and running too. Let's see, did I make all the highway connections, by the way? I might have forgotten one. Let's see now, we are connected to the highway here. We probably would like another highway connection here, actually. And one up here. Yeah, okay, so I forgot those. Oh, yeah, and we also want one higher connection out there. Well, that's going to be troublesome since I just connected a station or made some railway tracks there. Mm -hmm. And then again, we do have some end roads here we could tweak. Or I could even just use this road as a connection point. Yeah, we'll, prob we'll probably do that once we start building up this area. Of course, uh, now that we've connected these, we should get new uh, transit routes, hopefully. These bridges are a bit wonky, because given the uh, flood barrier on one side and the uh, quay... I still haven't looked up that word, quay, k, whatever. <laughs> that word. So there's that to deal with. Still no new mass transits at all. Uh, again, if you want me to start building that, do let me know, otherwise we'll keep clogging up the city just to see how much traffic we can actually handle. And it is getting quite crowded in some cer certain parts of the city. Especially the places where you're supposed to go down to the highway. This is a jam, dang it, yeah. This is sort of annoying when you use the small one-way streets. You get the classic wheel to all each other situation. So it's not an actual roundabout, sadly. Because then they would have yielded a bit differently. Ah oh well. I can slightly fix this by causing by making these roads on the other side one-way streets. Because that kind of prevents at least some of the clogging. Uh, but if I do that, it would cause more traffic through this roundabout. So that might not be optimal either. Then again, this is the artery into and off that one. Yeah, I think we're going to have to do that. We're going to have to make this one a one-way street. Let's start with that. And do we make, do we make it then one way the proper direction? Yes, good. So, then we'll come out here and go that way only. Here it isn't as vital. It's, it's okay if they come in. They most likely want to go this way. If they show out here, then yeah, that's going to be fine. Just this. Because now this queue will mostly drain out just fine. 
and that's actually the problem here. That's what clogged everything. Of course, everyone, anyone who wants is here and wants onto the highway will now have to go up here and then go all the way around. But I honestly think that's preferable. Uh, much the same thing is over, true over here. Though it isn't clogged up yet. We'll see how that ends up. We might have to do the same thing here. But I want to onto the highway instead, maybe. Um, wait a second, are you complaining about heating? I think you were. Hmm. Might have to get some more heating. So for all the traffic issues, well, there are quite a few of these. And again, we're gonna have that until we get a proper mass transit. I mean, we have 140,000 savings at this point. And still, the only mass transit we have is the rail line that goes from there down in that kind of square pattern. Going in a quarter of the city. Four stations or so, yeah. And of course, yeah, we're still gonna see this, for example. All the traffic in this area wants to get out on the highway. Now, I have set up a cargo exchange terminal down here. So that'll do. That'll function in the same way that the train station up here currently does, by uh, transferring cargo from the external rail network onto the internal rail network. At least that's the plan. Of course, there's no power down here, so they're kind of not working yet right now. Mm, we could fix that in some kind of an unorthodox manner, I suppose. We could make some of these nearby. But where? You know what, let's do that up here. So yeah, a few incinerators. That's gonna generate electricity. That's gonna power up these stations. Uh, there are also a few other stations here that aren't powered up. That's fine. Um, because this isn't actually in use yet. The one blinking out here, that's actually a radio mast. So, there's a high demand for commercial. You know what, I think I need to fix this rail network down here first, or road network. We wanted to connect to the highways. So how are we going to do that? I mean, there are a couple of ways. We could do it pretty straightforward like this. Or we could do a massive roundabout monster of some sort like this here. It works. It's not exactly pretty, but it works most of the time. Yeah, see here, we did that one-way street and there's no traffic here whatsoever anymore. Because all the traffic is now in the end roundabout here, trying to get down here so they can get onto the highway. Isn't that what's going on? I believe so. So ideally, we'd want a way to get onto the highway from over here somewhere. Maybe. Then again, I've tried these kinds of shenanigan roads before, like over here, and it isn't being used much. I mean, the traffic still wants to flow down here and onto the highway over in this incredibly busy intersection. So they won't really take the relief road, even though that's actually faster. It should be. I mean, you can speed along at 90 on this one. Whereas it's 60 down here. I don't quite see why they still insist on going that route. Oh well. So, yeah. That's why I'm thinking about building a relief from here and onto the highway system. Probably wouldn't work. Uh, what would work would be to connect this road here onto the other, the other road grid. Because then it would go that way. Instead of through here. Hmm. But doing that would mean another roundabout. Or breaking my own rules. Then again, it, it's still... Eh, the traffic still rotates. I mean, it's heavily trafficked, I grant you that. But still, as you can see, there aren't any mile-long queues. 
So I think we can accept that for now. It's when you get proper cues and cloggings like here that we have have an issue. Now this is not a roundabout, not a uh, highway intersection point. It is simply heavy traffic. And again, it's been simply because I'm using the one-way roads. If I used the uh, yeah, this one instead, this problem wouldn't be nearly as uh, um, nearly as great because as you can see, the highways here they actually get the traffic done, given the multiple lanes. The problem is, and the reason I avoided those was, well, as you might remember, that they zoned the corners. And though we did find out that we could get around that by just making sure, um, fixing the order you place the roads down. Well, kind of went with this design, and I kind of regret it. I also think that this is actually a louder design in terms of sound pollution, and because I've been getting a lot of sound pollution tweets. Oh, what's going on over here? Garbage. And dead people. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Not something we really care about at the moment. Um, let's see now. This road is... Is that a... Yeah, it's a regular tram road. Or, a, yeah, just a tram road. So, traffic would have to turn around here. Road traffic. Which should mean that a garbage truck should be able to go down there. Shouldn't it? Regular traffic should be able to turn here. Come on, let's see. Oh, the hearse just stopped there. Wait, you just stopped there? Why did the hearse disappear? It should drive back to the point of origin. Okay, I need to see some traffic down this lane. Something's wonky here. Because I'm starting to wonder if they're unable to actually turn there as I imagined. That's why I say the hearse here just disappeared. Traffic is going down that way. Oh, let's speed up. I need to see this now. What's going on here? And I'm gonna go and construct that highway up in, uh, up in Cape Knorr, but I really want to solve this problem first. What the heck is going on here? Come on. I'm not seeing any traffic there, which really worries me now. It should be service traffic at the very least. Okay, um... I might have to do a little road upgrade here. So if I upgrade this to a tram line... Only this far. to see. Is that the problem? Was it simply because this was connected directly that you couldn't turn here? Because they couldn't drive on the regular tram road. Yeah, see, another car goes around. Now you drive around and you turn there. Okay, so now you're able to turn. Because this becomes an intersection. See? Okay. So that's the problem. Uh, if you connect a, hi a tram line with only trams directly onto an avenue, car traffic will be unable to turn because it doesn't count as an intersection in the same way. Interesting. Okay, so now they will go down there. Which means I can technically zone these three these few squares. <clears throat> Let's do that. Um, 
Oh. <laughs> yeah, there's a slight height gap here. Oh, that doesn't look quite pretty. Um, of course, now I can solve this, can't I? Uh, isn't it possible for me to connect this to that? No, it's not. Dang it. Because of the uh, descent there. Are you able to build anything from this point? You could build in this direction. You'd be okay with me building up here. See, what I'm thinking about now is basically making connecting these two roads. We'll still have a tram-only section going down there. And I'll allow for those kinds of intersections. But that would at least solve the issue here with the avenue ending in uh, nothingness. Now this is kind of interesting, by the way, because that could have affect our uh, turn lanes as well. I mean, I've built quite a few of those little stumps. Let's see if we can find one. Oh, I have some of them. There we go. Stuff like this. And what I'm fearing now is that the traffic going down there can't actually turn here. Because this isn't a, doesn't allow for road traffic. Erg. That is kind of annoying. I just wanted a, I just wanted a turntable for the trams. But apparently I can't do that at the end of an avenue without causing issues for the road traffic. And if I make that a uh, proper road, that kind of breaks our whole roundabout rule. Wouldn't it? Unless I made the whole darn thing a roundabout. Just might be what we'll have to do. Hmm. Do I have any other end stops like that? Someone with stop with more room, like down here, maybe. Uh, I most likely can't upgrade it to two lane with tram tracks, can I? Uh, not all three sides, no gonna be too fat of a road. Can't upgrade, yeah, 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 I know. So if I disconnect those and try. Okay, so you're allowed the construction of them. Huh. Well, if you imagine this as a circle, it's, uh, it, it is actually a roundabout. Um, <laughs> but it's not exactly pretty. Um, so, let's see, what can we do here? So, let's see, if I like do a... One, two... Yeah, down here it's gonna be a bit wonky. More than a bit, but uh, distance too short. I thought, didn't I just do that on the other side? Okay, there we go. Yeah, it looks like I have to do something like this. So, well, um. Turn that way. Attribute you because I need to get one square further up. I've completely forgotten about that highway thing. <laughs> uh, let's see what well, that's where we were, I think. Okay. Just want to see if I can do this now. I'm curious now. Okay, perfect circle there. Yeah, that's going to be all wonky. Mainly because of the location. 
yeah, it's not gonna be a pretty circle unless I move it further up because of the wayside. And of course, we are gonna get the darn zonings, which isn't really what I was after here. Uh, okay, so let's prettify this uh, one square further back. Now, where the heck was that one square further back? There. Uh, let's try. Ugh, me and my eye measurements. Okay, I can make a perfect zone there. Good! Okay, so now I can make a good circle. Which is what I was after here. Okay, so now we have a circle, and right, we should probably also make this a one-way tram, not that I remember it. Yeah, that works. That works. So now this will actually be functioning. You're listening to the classics, the city's home for the hits from the 80s, 90s and onward. 1780s and 1890s, that is. I'll be oh. playing some less they were connected. gems from okay. those eras, so don't go away. Ah, they looked like they were connected. Come on. Okay, so I'll have to do that on all the cul-de-sacs. Okay. Because if I don't, road traffic won't actually be able to turn there. I must admit, I'm very tempted to do this, though. Just so I don't have to go and do this on every single road. <laughs> because fitting in an actual circle is kind of difficult. Of course, I have to find all the little dead ends, too. Because I, I made quite a few of them. Because they were so nice and functioning. Functional. Um, okay, which way are you going? That's the question. And did you set up new... Traffic lights? No, no new traffic lights. Priority signs. Those did change, so this is going to be the yield road, obviously. It'd have to be at this point. Because that is... yeah. Yeah, it'd have to be like that. This is the cul-de-sac one. And we need to do something similar down here. Well, technically there won't be anything to yield to, because traffic will only, only go down here and then around and that way. Traffic shouldn't go from here and down there. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep that. It's gonna be a lazy roundabout. <laughs> it is technically a roundabout. Doesn't quite look like it, I know, but yeah. Uh, I don't know where are the other ones? I know I have more of them. Like here. I need to track down them all. That track them all down. Arrgh. Ah, dang it. Oh, that's the problem. You can't... Oh. The park. So, how do I solve that? I basically need a structure out here. That won't interfere with the park. Grr! Stupid park. Why'd I put you there? Or I can make another road. There. I should still be able to make a road here. Can I connect these? Of course not. That would be stupid. Uh, okay, so I need to get from here uh, over there somehow. Okay, 
we don't make this one too long. Oh, dang it. Come on, game engine. Be nice. Be nice, dang it. Well, I suppose we could do it another way too. You built your offices in the wrong spot, my friend. Provided, of course, I can do that shenanigans I was thinking about. Um, there we go. Of course, I have to upgrade to go the other way around, but still. That is technically a roundabout. Very square roundabout, but still. But yeah, it looks like I'll have to do that in order for these to actually function. So that means that's priority road and that's yield road. Simply because it's a cul-de-sac. Of course, they won't be yielding to anything. They shouldn't, unless they're running around in circles. I mean, so, yeah, if it's a roundabout, we're supposed to do... Ah. That. I hate with it. Let's do that. We'll... If it's going to be a roundabout, it's going to be a roundabout. So it should obey the roundabout rules, even though traffic shouldn't actually flow in that direction. Um, that, of course, means I have to update the other ones, which I just did. Uh, which, I, which I just made. Grr! Where, where did I leave you guys? Where are you? Where are you? Oh, there's another one here. Yeah, th this is gonna take a while. We're gonna to track all these things down before we connect the highway system, I suppose. Uh, this one at least is more shaped like a roundabout. Though I have a hard time telling which way the traffic is actually going. But this should work. Now it's a proper intersection, so you actually get the road markers there. Saying which direction the traffic will flow. Um, wait. Oh, so this is too sharp a curve. That's what you're trying to tell me. Because I did upgrade you to this drill type. Didn't I? Yeah. Okay, well, we'll probably sort this out next time because it is time for a break but yeah so i'll have to fix all my little cul-de-sacs because avenue traffic can't turn around here if the tracks exiting are tram tracks only for whatever reason that particular square gets blocked for road traffic Grr. annoying discovery we'll sort it out though that'll be another time thank, thank you for watching